good morning to everyone i welcome you all class 2 evs see your students today we will discuss about a topic is organ health okay so what we will learn from this lesson okay we will learn from this lesson about the parts of the body and their work so each part how they will it will be works means so what is the function of the part of the body okay and next one know the need of cleanliness so cleanliness the personal cleanliness for a good health so how to be maintain a cleanliness personally how will be care so how to means how to maintain a cleanliness in a personal health so if we will be maintain a cleanliness so we will be it means we will keep a body is it means we will keep a, a good health okay so here uh, in the uh, it means in this lesson so start from here see the parts of the body so which are the parts of the body head eye ear nose mouth neck hand finger and leg okay so these all are the parts of the body okay so these parts of the body so how these all are working what is the function of these all or what is the work of these all see your students head so what it, what it do is to store the memories yes what it is so it is what is the work of head it is store the memories so whatever it means you uh, whenever in, in their time so it means to before two days it will be keep in the what it is pencil on the table in your room so after two days uh, we it means you are thinking where i kept my pencil you will remember and uh, remembering so what it what you will remembering so where i kept a pencil yes you remember that pencil and you will go and bring that so that is we can call as it means store the memory okay and i so what purpose we are using i to see the things we, we can see the beautiful nature okay to see the objects so this purpose we are using the eye ear to listen a sound to listen a music yes so to listen that means if the your mom is calling so you are listening that what you are listening so your mom voice you can be listening okay so that purpose means to listening a sound so next one nose to take a smell so to take a good smell flower smell fruit smell yes okay uh, food smell so we can take a smell that is it means we are using and also to breathe to we are breathing no so to breathe also we are using the nose and mouth what purpose we are using to talking to eat yes so i'm talking no so i'm mean to talking are as a to eat the food items so we are using the mouth neck what purpose we are using to neck is using for here to turn the face from any side means this side this side whatever it is okay so turn the face okay we are using for the neck so hand to what purpose we are using hand to work yes to work purpose we are using the hand and finger to hold the or things to hold the object if you means to hold the pencil pen so whatever book so to hold the object and leg what purpose we are using to move or to could means to can walk can move one from one place from the other place okay so we are moving from one place to other place so we are using leg okay so these all are the parts of the body and they work in detail we will be see in the textbook okay see your students we can see here the parts of the body yes see they can given here one boy so they can given here parts of the body what is called this one so we can call this is head okay yes we can call this is head what is we can call this one so it is nose okay and what we can call this one so this is mouth okay so what we can call this we can call this is eye so this one we can call neck okay and so this we can call as a hand so this finger okay next one so it is call a leg and last these all we can call as a toes okay 
so these all are the parts of the body head nose mouth eye neck hand finger leg and toes okay so these all are the parts of the body okay see they can given here so what they can given here so play a game i okay so divide your cells into two groups okay let the members of one group show a part of the body and let the other group say the name of part of the body and let the game continue to same way it means so you can make a two groups in one group they will say the parts of the body okay and one group they will say the parts of the body and another one group they show the part of the body okay like you will be play this one and here see here are some pictures parts of the body are also mentioned which part of your body do you use to perform the activity and that is in the picture they can be given here put the right mark so here work they can given here so so here they can be given here parts of the body mouth eye ear nose hand leg they can be given here okay so here in this picture which part is working okay so here which part is working here we will be so what we will do we write the mark okay here see which part is working here so here the leg is working she is what is she is running okay so leg is used for this one in this picture and here see the one of the boy is uh, taking smell of flower okay so here the which part is working here so this is nose so we'll write mark in the nose and here see students a boy is what is what he is doing is so he is a uh, putting a thorn okay so he is putting a thorn so in which part is working here so here the hands are working okay in hand we mark okay and next one a girl is listen a song yes so the girl is listening a song so here which part is working here so ear is working alma it means write a mark in the ear yes understood this one okay next one okay see here what they can given here so next one so she is using here microphone and she is singing yes so which part is working here so the part which one means here mouth is working yes understood this one okay the boy is standing and here see the birds okay he is seeing the birds which part is working here the which one so i is working to seeing the birds okay understood this one okay next one they can given here students see here so who i am so they can given here solve this riddle with the help of teachers or elders what they can given here so they will ask some questions here see so we will write the answer from here i am black but not a crow okay i am white but not butter i have water but not well i have lids but not a vessel who am i yes tell me students who am i so i am a black black in color but not a crow but not a crow i am a white white in color but not a butter yes so i have a water i have water but not a well i am not a well i have a water but i am not a well i have a lids but not a vessel yes who am i so we can call this is eyes yes okay so here see it means color of the eye is black okay and in the black in between it means see here white is there the middle ball is eye ball is black here white is there and i have a water in our eyes having the water but i have a lids eyelashes also is their closing yes closing and opening okay so but not a vessel so who am i i am a eyes okay so here eyes help us to see what purpose we are using to see okay so our how to protect our eyes 
so avoid the dust from getting into your eyes so we will be protect our eyes how we will be protect so avoid the dust particles enter into the eyes okay don't rub your eyes when a dust fall into it when it means dust it is fall into the eye don't rub the eyes okay show it your elders they will uh, they will tell you okay how to remove the dust particles okay understood this one how we can be protect our eyes okay and what is the function of eye and next one they can given here what they can given here i have two holes i help you smell without me you cannot breathe yes i have two holes see it is a nose so nose has nose have the two holes and it helps to take a smell it helps to breathe is yes, without me you cannot breathe without nose we can't to breathe yes so that is we can call as a nose okay so if the dust and uh, dust star enters so our nose when we walk outside it means when we are walking in the outside so if it is a dust is enters our nose hence we will be clean our nose every day what we will do here so we will be clean our nose every day don't put a sticks or pencils into the nose understood this one okay how to protect means don't put the sticks or pencils into the nose it means don't put any object into the nose okay so we can be protect from like so next one you need me to talk you need me to eat without me you cannot even laugh who am i yes we need to talk and also we need to eat okay without me it means we cannot even laugh who am i so we'll write mouth yes mouth is helps to eat mouth is helps to talk and also mouth is helps to laugh okay and yes students we can clean the mouth water as soon as you get up in the morning okay when in means which time we will be clean the mouth so in the get up in the morning so we will be clean the mouth and before and after every meal so we should clean our mouth understood this one okay next one in a little crocked well without any water though i am always there to help you listen to a lesson or song inserting sticks or chalk pieces will you only hurt you definitely who am i so i am ear okay so all right yes okay so a little crocked well like it is how it is it is a, like a well without any water though without any water into the ear so i am always there to help you what purpose it is help us to uh, help us so it is help us to a uh, listening or as a it means listening to listen a lesson or a song okay and how to protect the our ears don't insert any sticks or chalk piece into the eyes if you can be and means if you can be insert any objects into the ears so it will hurt you only okay so don't put stick crayons pencils sharp things into the ears okay we will be protect our sense organ okay so why do you close your eyes when there is a loud sound while bursting a bursting a crackers because that is very harsh sound for us okay so we can't listen that sound which sound the burning of crackers are as a loud speaker sound okay it will affect into the inner part of the ear okay understood this one okay okay see you students next one to write hold show and give you need my help and ever will you cannot take a morsel though so to your mouth without my will so who am i yes t to write hold and to give purpose we are using we need 
my help if ever you means without hand we can't to give anything for others we can't to write we can't to hold yes so here we will be using without it means to your mouth without my will it means i will we will tell and you okay so that is who am i so i am a hand okay see here there are fingers in hand how many fingers are there in hand observe the shape know the five fingers see here so observe these shape of the fingers okay and cut your nails regularly okay next one so wash your hands before and after eating okay so how we can be keep cleanliness of the hand okay understood this one wash your hand before and after eating okay so next one jumping skipping running and hopping i take you to the school for sure i help you walk and also play you dance and learn because i am here so here see so what purpose we are using for here who am i so i am a leg okay so here see so jumping skipping and running and hopping so i take you to the for what purpose so we used to for going to school yes so i help you work also and play also so we will dance and learn because of i am here who are my legs okay so there are toes in our legs yes toes in our legs observe that the shape of the finger and toes are different yes toes are different fingers toes are different so it is possible to walk without one leg one leg you are walking one leg using one leg so you are walking so if it is possible you can be try understood students okay this is here so up to we will be learn here from the functions of the body parts okay so next we'll continue this lesson in the next class thank you for watching